Well, my name is Tirkira and um, I am from India, uh, aka Delhi. Um, and I chose Halva because I thought it's like my favorite, personally my favorite breakfast and also because it's really authentic and I want people to know about it. Cześć, jestem Natalia. Zapraszam Was na kolejny odcinek z cyklu Daleko i Blisko Kuchnia Wielokulturowa. Dzisiaj jest ze mną koleżanka z Indii. Czy umiesz mówić po polsku? Jako tak. What's your name? Kira Kira. Ok. Chik Kira. Kira Kira. Chik Kira. Ok. Dzisiaj przygotujemy e, ulubione śniadanko chirchiry, czyli halwa. Halwa. To prepare halwa, we will need a cardamom, key butter, samalina, sugar, two glasses of water, a glass of milk, and pistachio. The key e, butter is masło klarowane, and semolina is kaszamana. First, we will start by heating up the pan. And then we will start adding the ghee powder for it to melt. Um, oh. <laughs> Oops, why isn't the okay. butter working? I have an idea. <laughs> okay. So once the butter has fully melted, we will take cardamom and kasha manna together and we will put it in the butter. Okay, now that the butter is almost fully melted, we will, we just have to wait for this piece to um, fully melt. Then we'll set the temperature to six. This? Yeah. Okay. And then we, uh, you can add the kasha manna and I will add a little uh, cashew. Sorry, cardamom. All of it, right? We have to stir uh, for five minutes. We have to make sure it doesn't burn. We have to make sure it turns into a golden brown. What is a uh, language in India? Well, there are a lot of languages, but the main language is Hindi. That's how we usually communicate to each other. If we don't know like most of the languages. Can you teach me some in Hindi? Well, if you want to say how are you, it's Apke Se Ho. And if you Ho, yeah. And then if you want to say hello, Namaste, that's actually really classic. Namaste. I think everybody knows that. <laughs> the way uh, you say Namaste, you don't say it normally. You actually go like this when you're with elders. Say Namaste like this. Yeah, Namaste. Uh, what is your passion? Well, my passion is drawing and playing the violin. You have a lesson in violin? Well, yeah. While Natalia is uh, stirring the key, uh, the key and the mixture, I will be taking a glass of water and a glass of milk while she's stirring. First, we add water. Keep stirring. Natalia will keep stirring now. And then while she's stirring, I will add a, a cup of milk. You can keep stirring, Natalia. Okay, so now we will start increasing the flame. Będziemy mieszać uh, hałwę, dopóki woda nie wyparuje. Why did you uh, 
this recipe. I choose this. Um, I chose this because there are actually a lot of fruits in uh, India, and halva is actually not very known in Poland. So I just want to show uh, people that like um, the, uh, you can try this dish, and like it's a really good dish too. Okay. Jak by zaczęło pryskać, można wziąć pokrywkę i i przykryć patę. Okay. Jak ktoś boi się, y, że go ochlapie, może się po prostu odsunąć i zawołać jakiegoś dorosłego. It, okay. It's ready because it's very... Uh, no, we, just, we need to add sugar now. Okay, now you, we can stir quickly. Can I do it? Yes, thanks. <laughs> Now it's forming a little bit. We, um, it's almost ready. We just have to add a few more ingredients. Let's take uh, two spoons and now we're gonna taste test it if we need more sugar. It could be really hot, so remember just to blow it a little before eating it. It's good. It's now we're gonna go take some pistachios. And then we're gonna put a few inside the halva. Oh. Oh. Okay, now we gotta mix a little more carefully because everything is like together now. Now we can uh, put the pan on the um, stone coaster and we can put them in bowls to try. Okay, Natalia, are you ready for some halva? Yes. It's done. I will put some in your, in your bowl. Okay. I... Now the halva is ready, and if you like raisins, you can put them in too. But uh, personally, I hate raisins. Uh, jak ktoś chce uh, dodać rodzynek, bo lubi, może do, uh, dodać do halwy, uh, ale nie trzeba, jak ktoś nie. Remember to always blow it because it comes straight out of the pan. O, jeszcze gorące. It's really good. To bardzo dobre. Bardzo dobre? Ha, to jest bardzo dobre. E, to był kolejny odcinek z cyklu Daleko i Blisko. E, e, to było śniadanko e, hinduskie. E, jest bardzo proste i smaczne, e, ale na koniec warto e, mieć dorosłego, żeby pomógł przy gorącej patelni. What do you like about India? Well, the best part about India is ceremonies and weddings. Usually the best part about weddings is the dance, which is called Sangeet, Indian dances. Um, tons of people. And then you get a lot of ceremonies, you dance, you eat food, you have feasts. It's really fun. And usually the funniest fact is small weddings have like, really small weddings have like 600, 400 people. And then the big ones have like 2,000, 4,000 people. Wow. We will appreciate your like and subscribe. Bye bye. Delicious. Delicioso. Delicioso.